We'll get to Newcastle and what's been clicking for them and what's mm. working for Eddie Howe right now. But Tottenham, this is a club that had a chance to really seize hold mm. of, of the top four and was not able to do that today, even close. No. Uh, it's the first day I've kind of looked at Ange Postacoglu and questioned a little bit about his tactics in the way that he's played teamed. And it's almost like we're going to go with this style of play, regardless of the scoreline, regardless of, of what's happening. And today, and, and the players don't get a free ride on that, today these players... Lost all physical duels, kind of lost all interest in the game. Uh, the big players didn't turn up. They didn't defend properly, which is, is, a, is a strength normally. They didn't attack well, which Newcastle were well set up for. And last season, Spurs came to St. James Park and lost 6-1 in a nightmare game. This was probably just as bad. The scoreline, not quite as much, but a 4-0 loss where they didn't really show anything that, that we've seen is, is, is nearly as bad. Playing too loose, what do you think, Robbie? Just a shocker. Absolute shocker. You know, philosophies apart, it was a shocker. For their philosophy, I said it, I think, at halftime, the football was, was not good enough, <clears throat> which means transitions. Transitions for them is, is when they ask their defenders to defend because that's the way they do. That's what the manager wants. And when those defenders don't defend very well, then you've got the football part, defensive part, you get a game like today. Plus, by the way, as Robbie said, soft. Soft spurs. And this is the worst uh, performance defeat under with Poch, uh, with Postacoglu, sorry, yeah. at Tottenham. So that's a, a real kind of learning experience for the manager. Hi there, I'm Rebecca Lowe, studio host for NBC's coverage of the Premier League. Don't forget to hit subscribe to watch more videos all season long. And for even more Premier League content, from original series to live matches, head over to Peacock. And be sure to tune in for Premier League mornings every weekend on USA Network and on Peacock. We will see you there.